This is Russell at Eye of Mine Action Cameras. This training video is going to show you how to install the vinyl overlays on your GoPro housing. Note that I'm recording this on our iView 720 video sunglasses, which are great for training videos and such. So when you get your kit, you're going to get your vinyl overlay and you're going to get a set of instructions. It looks a little intimidating, but it's really pretty easy. The numbers just show you uh, the order that you fold. This is the, the front, top, bottom, left and right. And that's the main overlay. And then you've got your top latch. You got your solid LCD screen, uh, a back, and you got your open LCD back, and you got your regular solid back and open back. This is the most difficult of all of them because it's just so thin; it's hard to uh, to get things to line up. Uh, but today I'm going to show you the main overlay and the solid LCD back sc uh, screen. Everything else is uh, works very similar. Now some of these are optional. And I'll point those out to you. The top latch you don't have to put on. That's that's up to you. And also there's a ring that goes over the uh, the black the black ring. That can be optional too. So let's go ahead and dive in. And I'm going to go ahead and, and and peel off. Well, the first thing you want to do is you want to take off the quick release from the bottom because it's gonna it's otherwise it's gonna be very difficult to get the uh, the vinyl into these nooks and crannies in here. And you also want to make sure that there's no fingerprints and this is very clean. Now one thing we did not include is the LCD uh, door for the wrist housing uh, because the wrist housing has the button on the left side and the normal wrist house or the normal housing has it on the right side. So uh, the, the wrist housing is not very popular so we didn't bother to do that but it's easy to modify the existing vinyl overlay just by uh, making a cutout on the, on the other side. Okay so I'm going to dive right in and we're going to do the main overlay for the the camera housing itself so you just peel this right off and you're going to see that the uh, the cutouts are going to uh, come right off this is for the the display the uh, button and the LC uh, the LCD linking light on the front now if you're going to use the the ring on the front uh, you're going to want to keep that and we'll talk about that in a second so the first thing you want to do is grab it at the four far four coat at the four corners and you want to get it nice and flat. What's important on this is lining up the display. So once you get the display lined up then everything else just falls into place. And there we go. I'm going to go kind of quick just for video purposes but that lined up very well and it looks very nice so I'm just going to push down. So now here's where you come into the numbers uh, on the instructions. Front first, top next, bottom, and then we do the flaps. So pull this up and pull that down, 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 and you're done. So now we do the exact same thing on this side. Put that down, a little flap here, and it's really that simple. So the main overlay is done. So now I'm gonna do the LCD door. I'm gonna do the solid one. Now it's important to know that uh, it's very difficult to get this thing to line up. So I am going to put a LCD screen in here to help me line it up. So the solid LCD door is this one right here at the top. So I'm going to peel this off. And you notice the, the hole stays right there. And here we go. Okay, so that's lined up. That's on the door. And now again we have numbers, so well, let's go ahead and take the LCD out. Top goes down, bottom goes down, flaps go in, just like an airplane. Flaps go down, here, here, and we're done. Okay, so let's go ahead and put that on the camera. I mean, I'm sorry, on the housing. And then we'll put the camera in with the LCD screen. Now the another option, there's, there's two options. One is the uh, top latch. You don't have to put it on, but I'm going to go ahead and put it on and show you how to make it work. Now the easiest way for this is to go to the back and line up the back. And then the rest just falls right into place. Okay, and now I'm going to do the optional ring. Now please note that there is a little tiny sliver of vinyl that you needed to cut off first 
And there it is. Take that off. And now we can grab the ring. Now, before you take it off, you got to line it up. So keep, if you, this is the top, that's the bottom. So that's how it needs to go on the camera uh, when you have a, a pattern. If you don't have a pattern, you don't have to worry about it. Okay. And there we go. So if, if you want to do the other doors, the open LCD door is here. The uh, regular flat door with the openings is here and the solid flat door is here. Uh, they are uh, waterproof. Uh, let it cure for 24 hours and then the glue will, will uh, become really sticky. And we put this in our pressure tank for an entire weekend and it didn't even want to come off. So, uh, But I do, not, I do not recommend this for scuba diving or any serious underwater because you need to be able to see uh, the camera in case there's a leak. You need to know whether something's going on and having an overlay on it may uh, you know, cover up some possible issue. And that's the Eye of Mine vinyl overlay.